Hello guys, this is Saiful Islam Shagor as your host and today I will show you how to control the filling tank in Factory.io. I will use ladder diagram for that. This is the tank. When you press the green button, water will fall as you set in timer. And when you press the yellow button, discharging bulb will be open. Soon the tank will be empty. Today we will make this. So we are starting right now. If you are new in here, start by clicking subscribe button. That's how you don't miss anything. We always make this kind of automation stuff. Let's go to the computer screen. Open factory software. Maximize it. Go scenes and click this three filling tank. Okay. Make this vertical. Mm -hmm. Okay. Remove this red button. Place a yellow button here. Press B or move vertically and take a display and press it here and configure this uh, display as integer okay now time to name this is as discharge discharge copy this okay and make it as discharge light okay and this is timer 2 okay great our setup is ready go driver and select mhj because we will use uh, win sps software okay select mhj will need more so configure as default see many input output give fill as i0.0 .0, dis discharge as i0.1 and uh, filling bulb q0.0 .0, discharge bulb q0.1 filling this is light and discharge light and give timer one in this section qw 100 and q2 to here okay all setup is done factory is ready open uh, win sps SRN software create new solution and make it water tank okay give it file destination documents win plc okay click create it will take some time be patient and go subscribe my channel okay click ob1 make it side by side press windows arrow key okay now we have to name every component here so go file take every component address and name here fill as i 0.0 discharge as i 0.1 see and fill bulb is q 0.0 fill bulb as q q 0.0 discharge bulb as q 0.1 filling light LIGST as q0.2 discharge light as q0.3 and timer 1 is qw 100 timer timer 2 as qw 2 okay now click a ladder it's time to program take this normal open and address is i 0.0 filling 
button and take this and Q 0, 0.0 filling bulb. That means when you press the green button, when you press this button, what filling bulb will start, water will fall. Take another block and uh, I 0 0.1 discharge and take output as Q 0 0.1. Okay. Now test it here, send all blocks, it will send all program to the factory, make it run, yes, okay, let's see, when you click the button, water is falling and when you press the discharge, so that means our program is working just fine, let's use this display and timer stop stop okay click it here and go catalog find timer i will use this se remember this se timer give it name tml1 and give it address as there is a 2s means 2 second I am giving it 10 second as 5 t hash 10 second 10 s means 10 second give enter and I will give uh, this display address qw 100 timer 1 again give take this timer name it as timer 1 this is uh, okay s s 5 t hash make it 12 second i'm giving it as i want and qw 102 this is the address of timer 2 okay now i will use uh, the light take it make it q light is q 0 0.2 0 0.2 okay discharge light that means when the bulb is running filling light will blow same in the discharge q 0 0.3 okay our program is ready okay send all blocks yes yes and click run and run it here you will see or oh, turn on the monitor mode we will see the change here when i press oh sorry i made a mistake here uh, both of this timer i give t1 Turn off monitor mode, make it T2, sorry, okay, again PLC send all blocks, yes, yes, make it run, when I press, okay, run it here, when I press this, timer is on and water is falling, turning on this monitor mode, we will see the changes here, you see filling bulb is on and light is on now it is off <clears throat> so discharge it you see 12 second and light is blue and this timer is on after 12 second this timer will automatic stop you see be patient this is discharging so how many time you will give let's discharge it all you have to set the timer with this meter as you see so how many time we will give first take a one shot this is not click yet click it here timer is on 
10 second wait okay that means 10 second will give 30 centimeter water so if you want 60 centimeter you will need to give 20 second that's normal stuff i think you will understand and there are some catalog and timer change it as you see you in the next video goodbye